It is from the galactic heart that the earth is brought to understand the time for change is given. The commanding vibration from the central sun sings forth the call of return. These messages of the teachers of light awaken the way show. Within the realm of the earth there are the star beings who have come to assist the awakening of humanity. They have come through higher dimensional portals within invisible ships to be part of the awakening. They have positioned themselves on important grid points for holding energy through the magnetic thought transference. In the third and fourth dimension beings incarnated as male are positioned out of alignment with their natures as the same has occurred with for females. The chakras are energetic placements which refuel the polar stream of the central strand which allows for the spherical magnetic fields around all bodies. Humanity has been specifically rewired to create dissonance and interference patterns which are involved in setting up emotional discord between the genders. This is most evident in the male's addiction to violence, greed and sex. In the female, the pattern has caused her to lose empowerment, resulting in submission, weakness, and toxicity. Humanity in the male body is out of alignment with the role of an active, loving, energetic pattern creation, and the female is out of alignment with her placement to be receptive, creative, and generative. The earth has understood this reversal and experienced the result of this emptiness which has caused humanity to become self-concerned materialistic parasites which have produced toxicity and rampant destruction of the ecosystem. From the central sun, the galactic heart is born and shines forth the central strand of the river of heaven that winds through the stars and focuses through the sun to the earth. The earth is connected to the heart center in humanity which in turn is connected to the mind and all the cells of each body. The reversal and blockage of connection within the body occurs where the heart chakra is misaligned in the male and female and there is discordance and static which is causing interference of the evolutionary waves of transformation. To be made whole again, humanity must listen to the tones coming from the earth to the heart and bring forth the sacred love that will empower again the feminine energy to replenish the oceans, rivers, lakes, and gardens. The awakening of the heart is a responsibility of both the male and female, and it is to be understood from the level of pure truth and promise to the earth that there is a great shift in motivation. Soon there will be released nutrients, technology, nourishment, energy, and inspiration which will enlighten humanity to attunement with evolved purpose. Upon this awakening, fear will be discharged, and those who engage in producing terror, conflict, separation, dissonance, static, and emotional distress will be inflicted with the pains of immediate karmic retribution. At this time, there is a full magnetic sweep of energies that are being sent forth by the teachers of light who are here to assist in the transformation of the earth. Humanity is responsible and has promised that this will occur, and they are the ones who have the authority to hold this cause as champions. The message that is coming from the star beings of the Pleiades, Cirrus, and Arcturus is that there is a global awakening through the connection called the Andromeda Enlightenment. 
As Andromeda moves with the Milky Way in harmony with the Prime Creator's purpose, the Earth holds the keys to the living beings wherein it is the holder of the sentience of all that exists within this dimensional reality. This is the domain of the living third dimension, in which all are in concert and communicating with the galactic heart and speaking with the recognition of the evolutionary changes that are here. On this plane there are several vortexes, grid points, which are being activated and held by the starlight beings. In the southern hemisphere, from the Black Sea to Australia and to Bali, and in the northern hemisphere, from Lake Michigan to Siberia and to Greenland. Here there are grid points which are assisting in the magnetic transference and holding the grid points that are disconnected from human avatars. They hold these positions before the earth changes are initiated. America holds the key to turning from the old world to the new. It is called the new world and it is the new world. It has been held hostage and blocked by the dark masters who have hoped to stop the transference of power from the heart of the great mother to the goddess who are to bring balance to the garden. The dark masters have called for war between the sons of light and the brothers of light and have kept them in conflict without the awareness of the oneness of these sons of the great mother, the earth. The call forth of the animals and creatures of the planet are now in their fullness. Time is ending as humanity moves into the stream of life which awakens. In America there is a challenge where each will have the opportunity to choose to bring forth the garden. The gate is open to those with love in their hearts and closed to those with fear. The teachers of life speak for the earth. We speak to you now so that you may begin to realize that you are awakened. The time has come to return to love and send energy from your heart of hearts into the earth and clearly walk away from fear. You have walked the path of fear, conflict and greed for many lifetimes, many timelines, many journeys of your heart and mind and now you see the emptiness of this path. It is up to you to let go of the fear of loss, lack and failure and to be awakened to your promise, mission and joy to bring to life the creation of your heart. It is your life now which is at the center of this message. It is your life which is brought to fulfillment. We are the teachers of life which speak for the way showers, the words that will bring you to enlightenment. There are many who wish to answer the call and be the teachers of life in the new age that has begun. You are to be strong and speak the truth. The truth is that which brings peace of mind and brings passion to the heart so that the creation is instilled with the life force of the father and the beauty of the mother. There is a pattern of creation which you are part of. You are part of the evolutionary changes within all beings and all creatures. You are not alone, you are all one. This is the message that the teachers of light bring to your world. This is the message that you bring to the followers who are seeking the path to the garden. From the wholeness of time and space within the third dimension of the material universe, you are given the perspective of limitations so that you may focus on specific events and change them in this time and space moment. In this realm, they can be concentrated and be filled with energy. From the awareness of the teachers of light as we breathe in the higher light of the seventh dimension, we are experiencing the feelings of your experience and know that you were well prepared for joy and fulfillment of the plan. These words are given so that you may understand the content and the feeling of the ever newness and of the changes which are present. You are gaining the capacity to reach within your consciousness and speak to the ones within the sea who walk upon the land, who crawl within the earth, fly in the skies and who travel the stars. The universe is alive with life. The focus of all life is expansion and the completion of the plan which is for experience to be shared and communicated. That message is through your communication you are bringing from the vibration which inhabits and inspires the attunement and the enlightenment of all that who follow and seek the path. They are the ones who know that there is a path to follow. They seek that which is within them. They do not seek that which is without and outside of them. So the followers follow within. They do not seek the outer. Thank you.